So I heard it was a hot girl summer. Knock knock, who's there? The one and only because girl, honey, like this one, a must have. Like definitely a must have. If you don't have her already after I give you this tea, this hot tea on this wig that I am wearing, definitely go ahead click the link down below and purchase her because this is all types of shit popping this like this is definitely giving me hot girl summer vibes like new wig who this okay hey you guys i am back with another wig review and this wig review is brought to you by divatress.com they was kind enough to send me yet another unit to review for you guys and girl girl honey this is definitely another hit so stay tuned for all the tea on this wig now um this is from outre and it's a swiss u-shaped lace front wig in the style riley in the color number one she is available in a variety of different color choices if you like to play in color or if you want to keep it basic and simple i feel like the jet black is just doing me all types of justice this is the model on the stock card and look at Ms. O'Reilly. She is a versatile style wig. I will somehow, you know, I will insert a clip of how the cap construction is. She has a total of five combs, four combs in the front, two in the middle, two on the side, and one in the back with an adjustable strap. She is a Swiss lace unit that you will have to cut from ear to ear, as well as the nape area. She does come with lace in the nape area that you'll have to cut. Right now, I am rocking her as a high pony, and I did utilize some of the baby hairs that it came with, and I just added some powder to my part. So that's pretty much how I styled mine. This is not fresh out the package, no honey. Like, and she still looks bomb. This wig is still hitting, like I worn her like five or six times already. If I didn't mention, she is big head friendly, and um, I would suggest you, you know, I guess wearing a wig grip or um, you know, got to be glued this wig down. So as far as the texture goes, she is very soft, very lightweight, and. I want to say she feels like a yakky so I have worn her a couple of times so she has become a little bit more yakky but still very soft and um, very like human hair like and you can use heat on this wig up to 400 degrees so I do suggest you flattening out the parting space wherever you want to wear your part she does give you the option to wear your part to the left to the right or the middles and i suggest whatever side you want to wear her or rock her um definitely use uh, a flat iron or a curling wand to flatten out the hair by the lace parting add your powder and you're good to go i'm just like really loving the versatility to this wig like she is giving me like human hair vibes like i love me a good curly wig and girl for me to have worn this synthetic then synthetic wig for over five wears already and she still looks bomb shalit this is shalit all the way um i do want to say i did add some mousse to the hair to bring the curls back but that was about it of course you're going to experience some shedding and some tangling but that's to be expected it's a synthetic wig sis like you do have to expect some shedding and tangling but that's not a deal breaker for me like i've been dealing with synthetic wigs for years now since i was 19 and girl that don't bother me she is still easy to detangle i feel like the hair is the perfect density like girl if you don't like big hair this one is not for you like she ain't come to play no games like this is giving me like really not really overly dramatic big hair but she does have a lot of volume to her so i feel like the density is pretty high on this wig i'm not feeling any tracks like no tracks just showing like girl like i'll try outdid themselves with this one like i'm definitely feeling her so she is um at a longer length i want to say about 20 inches to 22 inches long on me she is layered and like i said you can you know flip her over and you can kind of like you know make her look even more layered um i love the flip over method with this one but like i said for the sake of the video i'm gonna wear her as a top knot ponytail but somewhere i will insert a clip or whatever to show you how she looks styled each and every way so yeah it's not really nothing negative i can say about riley like she is definitely all types of hypeness like i'm not hyping this wig up for no reason like 
I love it. So check the link out down below to Diva Tress. The luster is really natural. It's not shiny and it's not ashy looking. Even though this is a jet black, she's like, she's like, she's looking like some healthy bundle hair. And y'all know, y'all know I love a good synthetic wig that gives me bundle vibes, you know like girl i got the bundles too okay she's gonna give you some bounce and some movement like she gonna move with you like this is photo shoot ready here so yeah like comment down below tell me what you guys think is miss riley a slave did we should slay her let me know in the comment section below subscribe click that bell to be notified every time i upload a like and share this video check out some of my other videos if you have not already and i'll talk to you guys later in my next one bye you guys